Hi guys, welcome to Cantonese Food Recipes. Today I'll be showing you guys how to make some barbecue char siu and chicken wings. So let me show you guys here. Yeah, Andrew, show us. Okay, here we got some pork belly. I've already cut it already. As you can see here, I've already uh, sliced it. Cut it into good thick pieces for the char siu. So after we grill it on the electric grill, uh, the meat will become, uh, what do you call it, um, well done. What so. he did here was he made some incisions so that it can absorb all that good marinade and it's easier to cook straight through. Mm. Okay, here we got like um, five, five pieces here. Okay, and here we got the chicken wings. These chicken wings, um, we just wash, I just washed them now, defrost them. Yeah, we're also gonna barbecue some of these chicken wings. Okay. Now first we're gonna be marinating this for for 12 hours so overnight. So we're gonna be grilling this during lunch. So now it's uh, midnight uh, no, it's uh, night time. It's the evening. Okay, let's do this. Just the two big mixing bowls. Okay. Okay, first uh, for the pork belly we're going to stab some holes into them so that when we marinate it, with all the sauces, uh, the sauces will be abs uh, will abs uh, what uh, absorb into the meat. He's going to stab it now, make some piercings all over. This will help the meat to absorb uh, all that rub and goodness from the marinade. Uh, look at those stabs. Tenderize it too from the pressure, gives it a nice flattening uh, massage. There you go. Okay. Pork skin. Skin as well. Okay, it's not. It's oh, not, it's not going through. Yeah, it's too thick it's too this thick. piece here, but it's good. You just stab the meat more here. Then we're going to carry on doing this for all our big pieces of pork belly. Tenderizing that pork. Mm. For the char siu, it's best to choose some pork belly with a little bit of fat. We all know that's where all the juicy goodness is. Yeah, when there's a uh, when there's fat, it's uh, very tasty with the fat we use. That's it. where all the flavor is. I like the fatty char siu. It tastes very good. If it's all just lean char siu, it's not that that good but it's good for char siu bao if it's and all that. lean it's not going to be juicy no more mm. it's going to be dry yeah. if it's too lean yeah you can see here this is what we call like mpalam five flour pork belly it means uh, there's a good layer of fat and then a good layer of lean meat in between yeah this meat they use it to five make uh, they use it to make crispy pork belly siu yo favorite but I like it to use it to make it the uh, char siu I prefer mm. siu yolk yeah but siu yolk siu yolk is like eating its uh, base flavors with the char siu it has more sweet flavors mm. and, and uh, scents just pound it up nicely there you go look at all them stab wounds there I'm just busy doing okay, some hip hop while doing it. We're going to be having a good lunch tomorrow. Lunch. Very nice barbecue. And the leftover char siu that you make, instant uh, lunch or breakfast or anything. Yeah, the leftovers, mm, instant. Very you just delicious. need some rice, some kind of starch. Okay, the chicken wings, meal. I'm also going to stab it a little bit. That it absorbs the rub and marinade nicely. Yeah, just a little bit. Just a tiny bit. Chicken's real easy. Yeah, just stab a little bit. So that also making it flatter. Yeah, so that all the flavors will go in. 
just now my hands were it's gonna be dirty. So yeah. This is a really cool contraption. Looks like it's made with nails. It's gonna be a barbecue feast tomorrow. Cantonese flavors, guys. Cantonese flavors. It's always the best. Real simple and easy. Anyone can do it. Very easy, guys, to cook. Very easy. Especially if it's on the grill. You have to get into it with the rub just now. That's how the flavors get absorbed. Basically, you can do this with any flavors you like. But this is the Cantonese flavor style. Flavor's just not on the outside, it's on the inside as well. Okay. You should try it. Done. So I'm just going to spread it out first. Okay, first we're going to... We're going to just sprinkle some salt all around it. Make a good dash of salt. Mm hmm Yeah. Okay. I'm just going to also sprinkle some white pepper as well. Good dash of white pepper all around there. There you go. Good. Okay. Snowing of it. So we're going to put some black pepper as well. Some black pepper. Oh yeah. Look at that light dusting of black pepper. Okay, not too much. So basically it's just, it's it like this. Now we're gonna make the sauce. So basically the sauce is the same. I'm gonna make two portions because I'm gonna put half here and half here and then I'll get my hands dirty. So first of all I'm going to add sugar. Add sugar. Okay, here I've got brown sugar. So, two portions I'll be using um, 12 teaspoons of sugar. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12 teaspoons of sugar. The paper's going up my nose. I can feel like I'm about to sneeze. Okay, I'm going to also add in the, uh, what's this, uh, Guangdong Mei Jiao. Guangdong Mei Jiao. Mei Jiao, it's a Chinese rice wine. Uh, let me show, let me just see, I'm just going to pour it enough. Good dash there. Yeah. Okay. Doesn't really matter. Let's say maybe five or six heat tablespoons. I also got to add in the so soy sauce. Some soy sauce, light soy sauce. Just enough to make a good, uh, uh, what do you call marination. We'll add in some oyster sauce. Okay, that should be enough. That's the choi san, choi -san oyster, oyster sauce. sauce. Choi san oyster sauce. Choi san ho yao. Also add in some uh, olive oil. Okay. And also add in some mushroom dark soy sauce. Mushroom dark soy sauce. Just for the color. Just enough. That should be enough. Nice dash there. Okay, then I'm also going to add in some sesame oil. Sesame oil for the aroma. Alright. Okay, now I'm going to whisk these ingredients up first. 
to melt the sugar. Yeah, to melt the sugar. Just to get the flavors in first. I can also smell that uh, rice uh, wine now. It's very strong. The rice wine helps to take out all that porky uh, rawness and chicken rawness. Mm. We all know that smell. Pat Sam mate, mm. we call it. Okay. Sang is like a like a fishy kind of smell, but in a porky way. Okay, next uh, it's time for the color. Okay, this is oh yeah, um, this is some kind of preserved tofu. It's a red, tofu. red uh, bean uh, bean paste, red bean paste. It's cubes though. It's not paste. It's preserved red bean curd. Yes. Yeah. So it's like tofu. Yeah. Did anyone get a good look at that? That oh, yeah. red color will give this the... This red gives the char siu and the mm. barbecue, it's nice. So the chicken wings will also get that red Ruby -ish color. Ruby-ish color. Yes. I'm going to put how many cubes? And some sauce there also. Just got that. that one cube. One cube there? One okay. cube. And then also add in some... Add in some sauce. That red, uh, that red, red paste. It's natural red coloring there. Mm. Okay. Okay. Next, I'm gonna add uh, add some char siu sauce. So it's two two po uh, what do you call it? two um, two dishes. So I usually use uh, three teaspoons for. For one dish, I'm going to add in six. That char siu sauce has a very nice and sweet aromatic This is the Dunky char siu sauce here. Flavor. Put six. Aroma. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. And then finally I'll add in the hoisin sauce. Pepper's getting to me. Okay, this is uh, hoisin sauce. Hoisin sauce? I, I think it was also Lee Kam Ki brand. We'll also put six. One, six heap teaspoons, three, four, five, six. There we go. I think it's best you don't need to block the camera with your hand. Why are you flipping it like that? How am I flipping it? You can see there, it, it changes when you flip it like that. Well, what can I do? You're blocking the view. Okay. There's so much space there. Okay. And I'm just going to mix it up. It's that, top, that bean curd there. Busy melding it all together. Almost breaking done. apart all the sugar and that red bean curd preservative. Pretty thick mixture right now. I can still hear some sugars not yet done it's yet. The bean curd, it's the bean, bean curd. curd. It should be done. Use pasta here. All right, it's ready. I'm time, time to get my hands up. dirty. You have to get it dirty 
the flavors okay, to seep in. Since I'm, I'm just gonna, what do you call it, um, clean my hands a little bit first. Okay. It's time to pour this in and get my hands dirty, guys. Let's do this. Come on. Let me, let me just take out the cling wrap as well. Look at this alcoholic oily goodness. It's gonna seep in overnight. Yeah, I don't know where's the cling wrap. I'll do it, do it later. Okay, just what we're gonna do is just put half and half into the bowl. Yeah. Sit here, put some here. Put more here. I'm sure the bottom has more sugary stuff in it because it's been a little while now since yeah. you've mixed the chicken it Chicken wings doesn't need that much. Yes, yeah, the pork. So that's the, the important. Pork, the pork is the most important. Give some more for the chicken wings. Yeah. A final concentrate there. Yeah, it Scoop was, out as much as you can. It was mixed properly. Just look at it. Nice. Very easy. And then tomorrow when we grill it, it'll be very delicious. When we grill tomorrow, I'll show you guys the, the glaze that I'll make. Okay, it's time to get my hands dirty, guys. Time to give it all a good massage. Mm. And let me, let me start with the, the pork. Oh damn, I forgot the, the five spice. Oh damn, you forgot the five spice. Damn it. I'm sure we can add it in now. Yeah, help me add it. I'll have to pause. Yeah, I'll pause. Back. Pause. Okay, we're back online. Okay, we're back, uh, guys. okay just give me one uh, heaped teaspoon. It should be enough, yes. Here's yes, a nice big heaped yeah. teaspoon. Just, just pour of it Of Chinese five spice. Yeah, just pour it around, yes. There yeah. you go. Yeah, it should be enough. You need put put a teaspoon of this in the chicken wings as well while we're at it. I don't it. think it needs, but a little bit. Uh, just a tiny bit, yeah, maybe just a, half yeah. a heaped. Yeah, Chinese just five a half spice. A heaped yes. teaspoon. Put it in there as well. It helps. Yes, you'll give it that there spicy you go. flavor. Oh, I can okay. smell the five spice now. Let me put it back. There we go. Okay. Get my hands dirty. Mix that spice into the meat, guys. It was supposed to be put in the mixture, but he forgot. It's the same, it's the same, it's gonna yeah. be mixed. Like the salt and pepper, just massage the meat nicely. Make sure it gets into every nook and cranny. Mm. Oh yeah, smelling good right now. Yeah, I can smell that char seal. I'll wait to barbecue later. it tomorrow. Mm. It's best to use the electric grill and not use a uh, charcoal. Because the electric grow, you'll know the you can turn the temperature. You can control the temperature. You can control the heat. If you're gonna be using charcoal to grow, some places will be well done and some won't be well done. So yeah. And all the smoke also is gonna be too smoky. Massage, massage properly all that meat. And oh. it will also burn quickly. Mm. Oh yeah. Let it lap it all up. Mm. You have to use your bare hands to, to do this. To feel where all the sauce will go in. Okay. okay, nice. I think it's ready, this one. Just do that and let it set in. It's time for the chicken wings, yeah. Time for the chicken wings. There we go. Mm. Just mix it all up nicely in there. Mm. Have some excess sauce there for the pork. It looks like it lapped up most of the sauce already. Yeah. But that's natural because the chicken wing is all smooth skin. No, yeah, no lacerations. But it will absorb the... Yeah, because of the stabbing. 
doesn't pieces. matter when we when we're gonna grow it. But there's yeah, extra sauce. Gonna, we just gonna pour it. Glaze. Yeah, we just gonna pour it over. We all know how to barbecue some delicious chicken wings. You must always add more. But guys, I'll also glaze. be using uh, maltose syrup for the glaze when we barbecue. I'm oh gonna, yeah, that is the secret. I'm gonna maltose use maltose syrup. syrup. I'm gonna add honey as well. I'm also gonna add char siu and hoisin sauce to it. Yeah, and some sugar. Hey man, did we forget something? What? Did you add chicken stock? Oh damn, we need a little bit of chicken stock here. Uh, I'm gonna stop again to get the chicken okay, stock Okay, stop guys. the video. Stop the... Okay guys, we're back online. We're back. Okay. Here's the chicken powder. Knorr the... chicken powder with chicken stock. I'm gonna be adding a nice heaped teaspoon here. Not, yeah. Not too much. Yeah, just just yeah. just a sp teaspoon. Yeah, pour pour it. Okay. Pour, pour it here. Put it in the chicken. Yeah, put it here. Okay, as you can see, just gonna lightly throw okay. it there. Also put it in the a little bit more there. for the pork. Yes. Yeah, it's fine. I'm gonna rub it again. It needs that uh, that MSG in it. That MSG, that chicken powder. Brings out the flavor of mm. the chicken. In your chicken and your pork. In Cantonese, you always have to put at least, uh, you have to put MSG savory, or, baby, savory. or chicken powder. It's what makes it, all our dishes taste delicious. Okay. Looks like there's a lot of sauce for the chicken wings here. It's fine, we'll use it as a glaze. Mm. Yeah, the chicken wings will As we're cooking, we pour it on top of it. Okay, let me just massage this. To reinforce the taste. into here. It's not. After the barbecuing, because you know when you're grilling, all that oil is escaping, so it's not very, very salty. It's more on the little bit of the sweet side due to the sugar. Mm. That's how chassis is supposed to be. We ain't eating no salty okay, meat. Okay, there's a lot of sauce. I'm just gonna maybe pour a bit of it here. Well, it's fine. It's chicken in there. I want it to. I want. Yeah, the, the pork, pork is more to absorb. important. All that flavor. Because of all the lacerations, it's going to absorb all the flavor. Okay, chicken's done. Now we're doing the pork. Okay, yeah. I'll Give do. it a good yeah. squish. Okay, this is a squishy massage. Okay. It all pays off. It's a good workout. Very nice. Okay. I'm gonna wash my hands, I'm all done. I'm gonna call my sister to just help me cling wrap this and then we'll put this in the fridge uh, for nearly 12 hours. And yeah, we're gonna grill it and we'll show you guys how delicious this meal will become. Okay, you can stop. Hi guys, so it's time to grill our chicken wings. We have marinated this, this over 48 hours now and all the juice has all absorbed into the chicken wings. We're first gonna grill our chicken wings then we'll do our char seal. Because the chicken wings uh, grow faster. The chicken wings you can see here I made a cut a slit so it will be An easier. incision. An incision. You made an incision in between the, the, the wing drumstick and the wing. Right at the end, at the elbow. Mmm, smelling so good already. That delicious cha siu smell. I'm gonna leave that extra juice there for glazing as it dries out. Extra flavor, extra delicious. Oh yeah. Just look at all these beautiful wings here. Yeah, I'm, I'm first going to grill it on high heat and then after it gets that uh, grill all around it then I'll turn, the, I'll, that I'll turn the heat crust. down. Mm. Okay, 
guys. Yeah, it's just been like three minutes. I'm gonna flip it around. Get, get that roll first. Look at that golden crust look. Get oh that yeah. Crust first. Oh damn. It's smelling so good here you, you won't yeah. believe it. Perfectly. A medium high heat. Get that crust first and then I can turn down the temperature and they can slowly slow, slow grow it. And after when it's well done, then we can uh, glaze it. Yeah, stop. The guys ready. I turn down the temperature. I'm just gonna flip it over and let it cook slowly. Let it grow. Cook it how long? Go slowly. Maybe 15 minutes? Well, uh, we'll see. Depends. Yeah, it depends on, on, on the type of grow we've got. Ooh, look at all that smoky goodness. Mm. Just look at the color. Imagine the char siu we're going to be grilling just now. Mm. It already has like a char siu look on these white wings. Smells like char siu at the moment. Oh yeah. Okay, now we're just going to let it uh, go for Slow maybe cook. five minutes and then we'll flip it there. Okay. Okay, it's been five minutes now. I'm gonna flip it over to grow five minutes again. And after that five minutes, we're gonna add, we're gonna brush our glaze on. Look at that. I think we still had some extra vachasu marinade. Yeah, we will put it over something. Mm. We don't want it too wet. Oh, the skin broke. Sticky, sticky. Mmm, just look at that color. A little bit of char there. Nice. Well, chicken is uh, it doesn't take long for it to get ready mm -hmm. well done so for after five minutes we glaze it and then we can we can put in our so our glaze sauce okay it's cool Okay, hi guys, so I made a sauce here. This sauce has a maltose syrup, honey, chasu sauce, hoisin sauce. Yeah, and that's it. And then after, I'm just gonna glaze it first and then uh, we'll leave it for five minutes and then we'll flip it over and we'll glaze it again. Stop glazing. Uh, Maybe you should move that side because you're blocking the camera. Yeah, mmm, look at that color. Glaze it first. Oh, here also comes put, the smoke. Also put some soy sauce and uh, dark soy sauce. For the color. Mmm. Oh, it's yi si. Siu kai ye. Oh yeah. Mmm. It's bubbling down there. Just leave it for five minutes. Okay. okay, guys, I just flipped it and look at that. And then I just glazed it, and then it should be ready. Just gonna flip it one more time, and it'll be ready, guys. Look at how beautiful that is. 
Wow, look at that. Guys, look at that. It's ready, guys. I'm gonna be plating this up. Smelling very delicious. Okay, guys, it's ready. It's plated. Look at this char seal wings here. Oh, yeah. Mm. It's looking so wonderful. This is our lunch. Today's New this Year's. This is our Christmas. Oh, no, it's New our New Year's, Year's Eve, Eve lunch. Bora Vos. Oh yeah, we're gonna be chowing down now. Oh yeah. Check that out. Just look at that. Put it in the sun. It'll look better. Oh yes, just look at that color. Just look at that. Yeah. Oh yeah, okay. Stop. I'm gonna eat now. I can't help it anymore. Hi guys. Well, we just did the chicken wings and now it's time to do the grill the, the char siu guys. Barbecue pork. Look at that, all marinated for two days now, looking very good and delicious. Okay, I turn the heat, heat up high now, let's put it on now. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I can feel the heat from here. Is Ooh. it looking good? Yeah. You're first making it on a high heat for the crust, mm. right? Yeah. And then later on you're going to turn it a little bit lower. Yeah. To cook it through. Now that they're barbecue wow. pork. It's a lot of pieces here. pork. Yum yum. A lot of pieces here. Is it big enough? Yeah, it's very big this time. <whistles> Just look at that. I make more smoking. It is smoking up in here. Today is New Year's Day. Kay. Happy New Year's, people. Nice. Oh, yeah. Oh. Just now I just put, when I flip it over, I'll dump the sauce on it as well. Look at that sizzling, the marinade. sizzling, smoky, sizzling, smoking. electric grill. Okay. okay. We'll, we'll, we'll put this on for like five minutes and then we'll flip it over. Stop. Look at that guys, look at that. Just now this will be so well cooked and then we'll glaze this up. Wow, look at that. Smoking. Guys, you're gonna flip it now. It's getting too hot. You don't want it to get too burnt. Just, you see? Oh, yeah. Get, get a bit of crust. And then we will do this slowly. Slow cook it. Look at that. Look at that pork skin. Nice. Look at that. Ooh, the smoke. Mm. Okay. okay Guys, wow, smoking here, yeah, smoking Well, I'll just put it on high heat for a few minutes and then we will do it slowly Check this out guys, I just put some sauce on top of it Okay, it's almost, almost done, then I'll turn the, uh, the level down a notch So we can slow cook it for nearly 15, 15 minutes we're gonna cook this five minutes each side. Nice. Okay, guys, it's been five minutes. Time to flip it over. Let's check that out. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, nicely charred. Little smoky today. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Mm. Look at all that quality goodness. I can't wait to chow down on these, baby. Yeah, I must turn down the heat a little bit. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Okay. Check out this, guys. Check out this. Oh, nice. Hey, guys, time to flip again. It's been five minutes. Oh, yeah. Look at all that oily goodness. Oh, and the smoke. This time it's been charred. Oh yeah. Mm. 
goes off the oil. Yeah, the oil the, and the, the smoke. Mm. Oh yeah, lovely. Okay. We're gonna glaze this now. We're gonna it's glaze good. it now? Yeah, okay. okay. Stop. Just gonna glaze it a bit first. Just a light glaze. Mm. Because we're gonna be flipping it just now. Bubbling, bubbling. Ooh, look at all that smoke. Time to give it the chasu color, guys. Mm. Color. Nice dinner, gonna be yummy. Oh, yes. Okay, we're just gonna leave it like this. We'll cook this for three minutes and then we'll flip it and glaze it again. Check at that, guys. Check at that. Nice, delicious char siu guys, very easy to make. Wow, look at that guys, look at that. Okay guys, it's time to glaze again. This side will glaze. Oh this yeah. Here. This time it's ultra charred. And this side will glaze. Yeah. We need to glaze. The glaze. Oh yeah, out the smoky. That's all the glaze. Glaze it. Mm. Ooh, smoky. All that sugar. That sweet goodness. Mm. Look at all that oil that came out of the pork. This is a healthier version of char siu, that's for sure. Mm. Finish up that glaze. Oh yeah. Almost ready, guys. Just will grow five minutes, five minutes. Mm. Nice. Big chunks of meat there. Okay. Check that out guys, check that out. Almost ready. Almost ready. Nice. Guys, I just flipped it now. Look how delicious this looks. Look at that. Nice. Okay guys, I flipped it around every two and a half uh, minutes. Looking very good. Almost ready guys. Almost ready. Delicious. Okay guys, it's ready. It's been 15 minutes now. Check that out. Ooh. Very good. Look at that. Oh yeah. Look at that piece. Oh yeah. It's still smoky. Still smoky. Smoky. But these, and charcoal. These black things, when we cut it, we're gonna cut it off a little bit. It was a little bit charred really there. Yeah. It was charred from the sugar. It's looking very good. It's still good. Ah, oh yeah. If we get the flame there. Check that out guys. Check that out. Ah, put it more in the sun. It's looking very good guys. Oh, the sun's gone but the natural light. Oh yeah. Smelling very good. Oh damn damn damn. Mm. Oh, right. fly wants to attack it because it's so good. Alright, we'll cut this up. Okay, guys.
We're gonna cut it up and eat it up. We're gonna see it just now. Do you switch it off? Why is it still on? What's wrong with you? Okay, guys, we're cutting the char seal. Looks a bit. Come to the whole hole. How over two sun hole. So, yeah, to my lady, not the tongue water. Tie jaw. Hm. What tie jaw? Long. I think this time I put the glaze too early. That's why it's a bit burnt. But we're gonna cut it off a bit. Still good after we cut it. Still looking good. Mm. Making sure the the plate looks clean before we plate the char seal. So about the good presentation look, guys. Okay. Mm. sharpen the, the knife first. Okay. Let's cut some delicious char seal, guys. Cut mm. mm. the char seal. Mm. Just cutting off the the burnt mm. parts. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, Mo Mm. Mm. Guys, it's smelling very good while it's while my mom's cutting it smelling very good. Mm. Look at that guys, look at that. Nice. Guys, when I first time made it, it looked uh, way better. It wasn't burnt. This time it's burnt because I put the glaze too early. But guys, if your one's burnt, you can also do like this. Just cut off some of the burns out and then it should be perfect. Mm, 
smells very good. Well, I'm really dumb so mean, no, Hama. Mmm, can't wait to eat this guys. Smelling very good and delicious. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm, guys, we, we have to make it look presentable, guys. Yes, look at that. Look at that. Wow, can't wait to eat this. Guys, if you like our recipes, please give my video a like. Turn on your post notifications and subscribe to my channel and comment about anything you don't understand or you or any recipes you want me to show you guys to make. I'll learn it for you and I'll show it to you guys. Nice, nice, nice. Look at that juicy fat. Juicy, juicy, juicy fat. Mm. Nice. Looking very good, very good. Mm. Mm. There's still one more. Mm. 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 Mm, look at that guys Wow You just add some cucumber and apple decorations Look at the dish It comes restaurant style Wow Very delicious Very delicious Mm. Okay. Guys, thanks thank you guys for watching. Can you see this deliciousness? If you learned something, please give this recipe a try. Please don't forget to like this video, comment and subscribe and turn on your post notifications. Thank you guys for watching. Until next time, gotcha gotcha.